Thank you. Welcome to another. You know, I feel like I need, I need to shout because you, you you threw away my microphone, Taylor. That's that's really stingy of you. So anyway, welcome to another edition of Entrepreneurs on Fuego. We are documenting the journey of amazing entrepreneurs, one digital footprint at a time. With me, I have uh, Cesar Garcia mm -hmm. and Elizabeth Grace Garcia with Wild Bird Studios. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you, welcome, Thank you very much. Welcome. I. I watched the video that you guys produce, and you're going to tell me all about what you do here in a minute, but I watched the video, and you asked me off camera, did you watch? I sure did. And I think that in a, the way that I would describe what you guys do is you have a phenomenal talent to humanize, to humanize an industry. And that industry could be the most boring industry in the world, medical clinic. It could be, my goodness, somebody making widgets or whatever. But I think that your ability to capture and to humanize the star or the entrepreneur into his or her business is what you do amazingly well. Thank you. Thank you. I don't think we could have said it better ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> that is our goal. That's our goal. Every time we have a client and, and mm -hmm. make a video for them is, you know, we want to capture, we say capture the heartbeat of that organization, the very DNA that makes them different. You know, there's lots of medical clinics. Why this one? Um, and so that means that we're doing our job well, so thank you. Well, it, it came across like that, and that's what I felt. You know, and, and if I were a movie reviewer, and I felt like at the end of the video, I should review this movie because it felt very warm. I felt, uh, I feel nice and cozy. Mm -hmm. I am gonna go to see this particular doctor because, yeah, it's genuine. Mm -hmm. It's genuine. And that sometimes is very hard to capture with non-actors, correct? Because mm -hmm. sure. you can't Absolutely. coach them, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, you can't say, hey, <laughs> act this way, or, you know, this reaction shot and right, everything right. else. But you were able to capture that from the other side of the camera. So that's, that's phenomenal. Okay. What, uh, what else do you, do you guys do, Sissa? What else do you guys do? Uh, well, for starters, uh, we're writers as well. Um, I like to think of myself as just an, art, an artist overall. We... What I'm really good at doing, in my opinion, what I was born to do, is just to have visions of things, um, particularly when telling stories and, again, this humanizing, I'd say, d different scenarios that can typically be boring for a lot of people, but, um, but really just being a visionary in, in writing, um, directing. Also, I worked in the medical field for about five years now, so okay. hence my, our experience in, in healthcare. And, and I had the same issue when it came to uh, just being in the medical field. I would fr it would be frustrating to see a lot of the folks perceiving healthcare as fairly stale, boring, but right. I mean, there were stories behind each and every one of these practitioners that weren't being captured, uh, whether it be in, in the patient's room or you know, any sort of advertisement medium. So outside of that, that's really what I do. Um, healthcare, I'm also an actor as well. I've been a, in the Arizona market for the same thing, five years. So I've, I've been very fortunate enough to work in, in the film industry, uh, worked with clients such as Walmart, PetSmart, Peter Piper Pizza. So cool. yeah, I, so I've been very fortunate to do that. So, so where, where does this passion come in, in combining your talents in forming Wild Bird Studios? Uh, with it, is your particular emphasis the medical field, or is it something, something else that, uh, or the industries that you are focusing on as well? It's a good question. Yeah. Um, we felt like we had a really unique opportunity because we have so many years of experience in, in business and in the film industry. We have great connections, know lots of great CEOs of companies, and we also know the best of the best in the film industry out here. So Wildberg Studios basically merges the gap, uh, you know, and we you know, we're not new to understanding the dynamic of an organization. We've both been in management before, so we've worked from our bottom, from the bottom to the way up. We're also not new in the cinematic industry, so we know, you know, you say, you saw that and you felt warm. Yes, yes. We know yes. what that means, what we need to do on our end to make you feel that way, if that's what the client wants you to feel. Um, and so it was just such a great opportunity for us and Wildbird Studios kind of, kind of was birthed out of the, those two worlds kind of incubating for so many years. And you know, we've been able to really hit the ground running uh, quickly and, and there's a lot of people that were like, you know, I was planning on doing a video anyways, but I know you, I know your quality of work, I trust you, you take it and you kind of 
fly with it. So, and, and I think that the fact that you both writers, storytellers, if you will, sure. it's just an amazing advantage than just putting together, you know, a very, all right, here's the camera, look at the camera, here's the script. Mm -hmm. uh, you told the story mm -hmm. and you took me through a little bit of a journey. You know, for about six minutes, then I, I was immersed into that journey. And I kind of was looking forward to hear uh, more of the testimonials. And then toward the end, in the closing of this particular video, then you have the employees coming on board and saying that they are very grateful and they're very proud to work in this. And I'm like, okay, that's, that's great. And then finally, then there is the doctor who really doesn't appear at all <laughs> or very seldom during this. And so... I thought that that ability for you guys, that you guys have to tell a story, is amazing in, in, in what you do. Well, thank you. Well, Gessler is being very modest. He is very, he has a gift. He sees people. He sees people in a way that not everyone does. And I think because of that, we're able to then tell the story. But he captures that I dynamic. I saw that. Yeah. I saw that. You have to have, and, and there was something more there than just, the you know just the shot and all right we're going to create a video blah blah blah, blah. Mm -hmm. there was more there mm -hmm. and now that i know that you're a writer so there, there was more mm -hmm. yeah. absolutely well you know stories growing up i grew up in a very um let's say impoverished place and so stories were the thing our escape you know it was our imagination so i believe there's so much power in imagination and really capturing um just anybody's story um that's really what's going to personalize somebody's business. I'm a personal believer that every entrepreneur has four dimensions, and that's the dreamer, the thinker, the leader, and the storyteller. And so what we're asking is for entrepreneurs to invest in their storytelling abilities. And people, again, things can be so competitive, sure. but again, when we capture the why of a business, if we really capture their story, that's really what's going to hook them in. Uh, just like this video, there, there are how many clinics in, in the valley? Why this one? Uh, what is it that makes you feel warm and fuzzy inside? It's their story. And that's really, I mean, outside of business and outside of, well, you know, even production. I mean, production is really, and, and film and cinema is a, merely a platform. And to be able to capture that is very powerful. Mm -hmm. So, you know, everybody has a story, and that's what makes us unique, even on a humanitarian level. Again, I love what you said about, you know, just what we, we've done and delivered. We humanize a fairly stale, yeah. or I guess a product, but that's, again, we like to capture the jelly and the donut, if you will. You know, it's just, <laughs> that's, that's what we're after, so. And, and I think that that makes you very distinct in the video world, mm -hmm. in the video production world. Um, and. Our video producer uh, here, uh, Taylor, she's just amazing with her video company. And they're one of the top Phoenix video producers. In your case, what I saw is that you have found, and it's not in direct competition because you have a different angle. Mm -hmm. You're a storyteller. Right. You're a storyteller. And, and because of, I, I would imagine because of your actor background, you can see the world much, much differently than perhaps other video production companies have. Uh, and that's what I saw in your videos, and that's, I think, the value proposition that you have for your company, man. So it's, oh, it's really, you. really thank phenomenal you. The, guys, thank you. Thank the way you. you guys are working it out. So, what, so what's next for Wild Bird Productions? Uh, well, we're working on, uh, with a big company right now, I can't give too much away, but it's a sort of a global organization. They have a ministry that they said they wanted a video that's going to transcend all races, ages, religions, and we want it to kind of capture the heart and uh, really move people in a powerful way. So we're deep in pre-production for that. That'll be released in February of next 2016, uh, and uh, it's it's a pretty it's a pretty big and pretty beautiful project that we are fortunate to be a part of. We're we're hoping to capture with this video that passion that is coming through right now. I mean, you, you're talking about it. You're like you just can't wait until <laughs> it's done, man. And, and so hopefully we'll be able to see it here as well in Entrepreneurs sure. of Fuego, mm -hmm. which will be phenomenal. Absolutely. But but I have no doubt that with the talents that you folks have, uh, and with the multiculturalism that you're you're exp uh, trying to uh, explore with this particular project, um, no doubt it'll be a success. Thank you. Thank you. That'll be a success, Thank and that's you. that's that's a sense. You know, the essence of 
us as entrepreneurs, mm -hmm. right? It's just Absolutely. finding that passion and telling the story. Mm -hmm. It always, always boils down to that. If you can tell a story, you have passion, mm -hmm. like you can folks do, then that's perfect. And for your company, man, that's a great angle, man. I really, I really think it is. Thank you. Thank you very much. Cinematic so. storytelling, the eyes can see and the heart can feel is Wild Bird Studios. <laughs> and with that, I, I don't know what else to say, but we're out.